Hey everyone, uh, I just thought I'd show off the uh, fruits of my uh, labor for the week. This is the electronics enclosure for my router. This is holds the stepper motor drivers and the power supply. Um, so I just thought I'd show this off. So, got a nice uh, hinged front here. There's the uh, the G540 stepper motor driver, um, and there's a there's a power switch. It's kind of kind of hard to see right there. Little toggle switch. Um, I may end up moving that. That there was just a convenient hole already in this top piece for that, so I decided to put it there. Um, but I've got that all wired in. So uh, when I flip the switch, and you see it comes on. It, uh, I've got a pair of fans, one here at the, at the bottom and one at the top. So, uh, this is going to be a little tricky to, tricky to open this thing up. But the top section kind of folds away. Yeah, sorry about that. Hard to do one-handed. Um, so here's the, the inside. Uh, first of all, there's the bottom of the G540, which is the uh, the power supply uh, uh, coming into it. Uh, there's the switch, and then there's the power supply. Um, as I may have said before, the power supply came uh, in a box, um, kind of like a computer power supply, but once I opened it, I found I could kind of flip it open um, into two halves, and then uh, and then I got everything got everything hooked up. Um, it, it looks a little bit messier than I would normally like, uh, but it's, well, it doesn't much look like it, but it is under control. Um, everything's going to where it's supposed to. Um, I got a little separate 12 volt supply there for the, for the fans at the, at the top there and they're at the bottom. So all I need to do now, um, is, is fix the, uh, the top section here uh, with a couple of uh, feed throughs. I don't know where I'm going to put them up here at the top or on the side or, or wherever. I need to figure out where it's going to mount on the router. Um, but there'll be uh, um, the cabling to the uh, stepper motors and then also the, uh, the, the parallel port there that goes out to the computer. I'm not sure how I'm going to do that yet. Um, since I've been able so far to make everything nice and clean, I'd like to not hack a big hole in the side of the box to run a parallel cable so uh, I may have to work out something uh, something clever but uh, anyway that's uh, that's that it's ready to start hooking up to a computer pretty much thanks